Hello, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. This is Torin Atkinson coming at you from the internet in my drawing cave. Every Sunday morning I draw a monster, hopefully in 20 minutes, usually a couple minutes extra for some extra finessing. Um, and I go, I'm going through the Advanced Dungeons and Dragons Fiend Folio, and I am on the letter, oh, I'm on the letter J. Last week was I for Iron Cobra. Today is J. The uh, music may be a bit loud. Okay, I'll turn that down. Thank you. It's very bombastic. All right. Should be better now. Um, thank you, Charles Smith Org, in the Twitch chat. Come on and join me on Twitch TV slash Torn Atkinson. As you can see on your screen if you're watching. I also post on YouTube. Um, if you like what I do, hey, Patreon is a thing. And... Um, uh, come and check me out on Facebook, on Instagram, and I do have original artwork for sale. I was a um, an artist, an illustrator for Dungeons and Dragons, all the way back to TSR. My first thing I did was in the Wizard Spell Compendium, Volume Two. Good stuff. Um, yeah, and I'm working on some stuff right now, which is very exciting. I can show you a little preview. Let's see if I can. I'm working on a thing for a guy. Uh, there we go. I can just show you briefly, just ever so briefly. There we go. That's a thing. I'm, um, I haven't quite finished it yet. I'm just working on the, the snake staff. So that's what I was working on yesterday. Good stuff, good stuff. I got two more, uh, one more to do for that guy, and then I got another to do, another, uh, cover to do for a Mutant Crawl Classics book. So that's pretty exciting. All right. Enough of this gay banter. Today's creature is the Germ Lane from the Fiend Folio, also known as Jinxkins. Um, look at all this crazy text. Look at all that. We're not going to read all that. Luckily, I read it ahead of time and made some notes. So <laughs> the important thing is they are very small. They're about a foot tall. The uh, number appearing is 12 to 48. I'm definitely not drawing 48 of these guys. I may draw, I don't know, five or six. We'll see. Um, but I'm also going to draw some rats. Germlane, or Jinxkins, sometimes known as Bane Midges, dwell in elaborate tunnel and den warrants beneath the ground, often very deep beneath the surface, as they mix freely with rats of all sorts, uh, even the giant variety. They are often found in the company of such rodents and are likely to be sharing an integrated system of burrows, tunnels, and holes. These evil runts... Um, sorry, I'm just getting navigating here. Um, ...are cowardly, and will attack only when it seems probable that they can overwhelm victims without serious opposition. Thus, they waylay weakened and wounded parties or single individuals who are unwary, asleep, etc. While strong groups or alert adventurers will not be physically attacked, germlane bands will certainly seek to cause them harm and injure them out of their sheer maliciousness. <clears throat> germlane are very fast, moving with a scuttling gait, very quiet, masters of remaining unseen. On occasion, however, if a party or individual suddenly becomes still and listens carefully, their movement or twittering, squeaking speech can be detected. Um, blah, 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 blah. Their favorite attack method is ambush with pit or net. There's a, you can see a picture of them down here at the bottom here. Um, they'd like to take victims alive. Some victims will be devoured by the germ lane for, or their rat friends. But most humans will be stripped naked, shaved, <laughs> and left trust and helpless in the uh, passageway. The germ lane will usually watch such victims from a safe hide, awaiting the fun of seeing some passing monster come and devour the bound victims. Um, when I was on the Facebook yesterday asking, what kind of scenario should I be drawing uh, the germ lane? Somebody recounted uh, they had a gnome character, and this is exactly what happened to their gnome character. They were caught, <laughs> a sh a shaved, uh, uh, declothed, and shaved naked. Uh, so that was pretty funny. Um, the gray-brown warty hide of germlane blends with earth and stone, but they always dress in scraps and rags. Blah, 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 blah. 
description. Jinxkins look as if they are diminutive humans wearing baggy clothing and ill-fitting leather helmets. Closer inspection will show that the baggy garments are actually the creature's lumpy and many-folded skins, while the helmets are in reality the pointed and evilly visaged heads, all leathering and smooth. The limbs of these creatures are knotty and bowed. Bowed? Yes, with hands and feet tipped with thick nails, which are always filthy, but nimble. All right, so you can see, here's the, here's the, uh, here's the guy. Let me grab one of these for reference. Maybe just this whole picture here. And we can just put that, keep that there. I don't need the yellow anymore. So now, so we got that. Here is the, let me zoom out. Here is the Tony Ditcherlizzi version of the, yes, shaved Charles Smith, shaved. Here is the uh, Tony Titalizzi version of probably from the Monstrous Compendium. That's good stuff. He's got his darts in his little backpack there. He's got a, his foldy, foldy skin. That's great. I don't think we'll be using this as a uh, reference. Uh, what's this? Oh, yes. Okay. So, oh, wait. Before I get to that, here is um, third edition. These guys were in the Monster Manual 2 Warty. And uh, looking a little more rat-like with those big schnozzes. Um, so, as I was doing my research, uh, many people on the internet said that these were likely inspired by the movie Don't Be Afraid of the Dark from 1972, which had these exact creatures here, <laughs> and they did exactly what was described in the um, in the description of them. They these, this couple moved into a house. And they were being, or the woman specifically was being tormented by these diminutive little creatures who were like leaving traps out and stringing wires across stairways and leaving uh, stabby things on the floor uh, for people to step on and all that kind of stuff. So that's, that's fun. Uh, yeah, and then, so what I decided to do is to draw, uh, because it's the letter J today, I thought it might be some having the um, germlane jousting, uh, and I'm using juniper as the color. I've chosen juniper germlanes jousting jovially uh, for some uh, jelly jars, jars of jelly. My J's look like S's, but something like that. So we'll see how much we can fit in there. So it is ten twelve. So we want to be done by 10.32, and let us begin the drawing. So I think I'm going to have one of the rats over this. So I looked up uh, A Knight's Tale to see if I could find some interesting composition, but not really. So uh, let's have a uh, let's have a, one of these guys here. And he's got his jousting thing, and this guy is like, Oh no, I've been st struck upon the head. I guess this one would be, if I want to do that, oh, I might make them into really long candy canes for the festive, because apparently they all, I didn't see it in the description, but someone on the, one of the groups was telling me, no, it's got to be, it's got to be contacting, I don't know why I'm, why I'm ending it, and uh, this is the rat, uh, so let's, I don't know, where should we, should we be jousting him in the junk, how should I be? Oh, maybe it'll just maybe it'll just be like oh, <laughs> like right in the solar plexus. Oh. And the rat will be like, what the fuck? Ratus, ratus. You know, something like that. I did get. I brought. Where is it? Rat anatomy. I thought that might be useful to have on hand. Looks like it's just Charles in the chat today. People, I guess people are busy doing their uh, Christmassy type stuff. Probably like, oh shit. Now we're going, this is what's happened to me. Like, I'm like, I'm not gonna buy anyone Christmas presents. I'm a Grinch. If I need to, I'll make something. I'll just, uh, uh, flatten? No, that's not what I want. What do I want? I want to rasterize that. Rasterize that layer. Good. I don't know why I'm so obsessive about margins, but. I do this all day at work, like, ugh. <laughs> okay. Let's keep that, keep that 
there. So I don't get two. Now in the background, I kind of wanted them to have this uh, be like in it. So let's let's actually shrink this a little bit. Get some, get some room. Get some room. Maybe I guess the uh, jam jars will be down here in the background. Maybe like some jam lanes cheering them on. But I wanted to be like, I wanted them to have like, I wanted to show the burrows somehow. I don't know if I have enough space for that. But like maybe there's some, some more. Maybe I will be drawing 48 germ lane. <laughs> All right. Pointy heads. And rats. I'm going to get my rat. Let's flip this. Transform. Transform. Something like that. Kind of had a long way. I also looked up some. Uh... I mean, look at this guy. Look at this running rat. Look how long his body is. Just grabbed it just before I look at this. I love this picture. Maybe I should keep that as a reference too, but I'll keep it off on the other monitor if I need it. Um, I just want to get the shapes going on here. The shapes, right? And this guy would be like, I'm riding the rat. I want to have them. I don't know if I have time, but I kind of want to get them having some. Like gel, like I don't know, helmets or something. And I don't know, but his arm, his arm, shoulder would be here. Should it be fragments there? <laughs> This rat. Do I have a, a rat reference for this guy? I have. Uh, sure, let's use this one. Let's, let's see if I can bring it in. And just bring it there. Look at that happy little rat. Uh, I don't know why he's in such pain. He's not the one being struck, but I guess he's alarmed. So we'll do that. Just blocking in the shapes right now. That's his. But his, his hand will actually be like, let's put them spread out. And his body is twisted, twisted, twisted. Something like that? I don't know. No, oh, that makes him look like he's standing too much. Maybe it'd be like, maybe that should be more like that. Yeah, I think that's going to work. Okay. And then in his tail, I don't know. I don't know. Let's, let's do that. I don't think they. I don't think rat tails twist that much, but I don't know. Maybe they do. All right, and then these will be the jars of jam. Maybe one of them is. Oh yeah. Oh snap. Maybe one of them is uh, tipped over, and there's a guy who's like sneaking some of the. You know, I'm not gonna have time to draw all this crap. <laughs> but uh, okay, so that's we have our basic shapes now we're going to go into the final let's make our is that about the right 60 55 let's do 55 okay germlane let me get my germlane reference out no i don't want that anymore looks like they have uh little elf elven pointy ears i right, keep that down here right above the layer and let's draw these guys Ah, uh, I'm trying to. Oh, long layer. This is my new layer. Let's make it red so I don't don't get confused. And he's gonna have. Well, where's his 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 thing will be like? Here. Okay, now. Now I feel it's too thin. Nope. Oh. And I don't know where to put his lance. Well, maybe I figure that out later. Baggy skin. Maybe 
maybe it's actually still in his hand? His pointy head, ears, disgusting nose. I feel like his nose should be a little more ratty. I don't know. Let's give him a long nose. Ah, some pointy teeth. That's something. That's something. I want to give him some hair. Even though the originals don't have hair. Arm. Maybe he was just holding on to his... Cane. Oh, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna draw it in. There's his hand. Maybe I will give him a hat. Doesn't really look like a hat, does it? Maybe if I give it some... Ooh, weird. <laughs> this guy's gonna have a hat. Maybe even like a visor. see his pointy head if I do that. Let me just make it extra pointy. Let's get rid of that visor. This is taking way too much time. Alright, let's give him a let's give him more of a rat nose. This looks very cartoonish. <laughs> Very cartoonish indeed, but that's okay. I'm not really making there. Their skin is saggy as they should be. So we got a uh, coming up here. Oh, fragments. And these will be definitely going to be candy canes, right? So then that would come down like here. Some candy canes that they stole from old Saint Nick. Maybe he's the gnome. And then his arms. Scabrous leg. Is that a rat nose? Is that a rat schnoz? Let me look up. I should be more pointed down. Yes, yeah, like that. Okay, and then. <laughs> and of course, the teeth. Maybe. Sketchy rats. that. Oh, maybe some more. A little bit of mouth <laughs> might be might be useful. Some uh, fucking uh, Good, good. Feel like maybe needs some some kind of saddle or something, I don't know. Doesn't really look like anything. Whatever. <laughs> Alright, here we go, here we go. I know what to do. I know what to do. Here we go. Yeah, I 
think that's that guy. I don't know. I really hate this face. Let's redraw the face. What am I even drawing there? Good Christ. I've lost my drawing skills, everyone. I can't draw anymore. I'm sorry. Okay, so that's that guy. Let's draw this guy. Where's my reference? There we go. Yeah. <laughs> I like it. Oh, that. <laughs> I really like it. What a great, what a great shot. Seems that this guy's like this rat's being really overly dramatic. That's the way we like it. Okay. Let's do put his. Let's see. Okay, great. And then do his center line here. You make it out? Am I making it out? This this is a rat. Ba -ba I feel like we should have an eye here. You know. Doesn't really make sense, does it? Let me just. So where is this, where is this, this guy is having the, I still don't have this, that's why this guy's losing, because he doesn't have a lance. Times 1027. Okay, I really, I really gotta get. Ugh. I really gotta get going. Add some texture here. I don't know. Don't overdo it. Don't overdo it. I'm trying to make. It's hard to. When you're really drawing sketchy like this, it's hard, hard to draw anatomy properly while also having baggy skin on these guys. So that's. That's the trouble I'm having. All right, so, oh, let's draw this guy's tail. My brother had a rat for a, for a time. That rat is not alive anymore. To nobody's surprise. Kind of doing this. The rat and the dude are kind of doing the same. <laughs> let's let's give this guy a harness. Let's make it checkered. Let's make it more. Let's make it more. Uh, that looks terrible. I hate it. Thanks. I hate it. So let's have, I don't know, 
again. Maybe, maybe this is it here. Scar. That's just mucking up. It's just mucking things up. Let's leave him. Let's just give him a simple harness here, and then just leave it at that. It looks like kind of S and M business, but oh well. <laughs> All right, that's fine. Okay, so that is the jousting part. This guy. All right, let's put his. Let's see if we can f put his. Candy cane in here somewhere. Oh god. It's a festive, festive time. And then, uh, okay, how are we doing? Okay, we got two more minutes. We're not gonna finish this in two more minutes. Let's get some exciting. plane in here and uh, this is the cave <laughs> something like that and then uh, let's get some I feel like this should be a different color maybe let's get a lighter Let's see if this is going to work. It might not work. No, it should be. Let's do the same color, but we'll just have it. Uh, I know what to do. I know what to do. Okay, so here's our here's our new layer. We'll make it green. Orange is fine as well. <laughs> and we'll just have... We'll change it afterwards. And we'll just have, like... Uh, stop drawing round heads. They have... Yay! Yay! Someone coming out of there. Hole. Pointy head, though. Pointy head. Boom, dun, 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 dun. Pointy head. Yeah! We like this thing that's happening. And then, okay, now here is the... Here is the... Jar of jellies. Jar of jujubes. Let's draw some jujubes. And this guy is like eating one. He's eating one of the jujubes. Oh, no, no, no. I'm just going to say they're jujubes. Jelly jujubes. This guy is he's not supposed to be eating the jujubes. But he is definitely eating the jujubes. Some shapes in there. I guess two jars of jujubes is enough. That way we can get another. This guy's pointing. Look! Look what's happening! He's happy. <laughs> Just a shape. Just a shape of a guy. Okay, so that's the... That's... Oh, yeah, we get some more guys going up here. These guys are buddies. Do you think there's female germ lanes? Jinxkins? dim sum pretty soon so we gotta wrap this up plus we're also um, we're officially a minute over okay so here's what we're gonna do we don't need this layer at all anymore we're gonna make this layer a little lighter and we're gonna make this layer a little darker oh yeah let's just uh 
Bop. I feel like, should I put some red in? Oh, my computer is thinking. <laughs> I've already drawn all this. We're just watching the computer. Let's add, I feel like I do want to add some tone. So let's go back. Let's go back to this. Grab that color. And maybe we'll just uh, grab a different brush. One of my favorite brushes is this guy up here, sample brush. Let's make it an own layer just in case I decide I made a terrible mistake. Let's make the rats dark colored. And we can leave the... I mean, there'd be some shade here. But not, not a lot. The rats will be mostly, mostly dark. We can make it a little bit. I don't know. How does that look, everyone? Who's in the chat? Is anyone at? I haven't been, totally been ignoring the chat. Uncle D is here. Ahoy! Oh, there's four people. Wonderful. Um, let me just modify slightly. Speaking of rat fingers, as I just saw in the chat, maybe that's maybe that's the way I should have done the. That's too late now. It's too late. Too late for love. And, uh, yeah, let's get some ratus ratus. Just some highlights, some fur texture. And I think that's pretty much, I think that's pretty much it. I think we did it. I feel like we're done. Maybe like, oh, this is, a, uh, this is a rogue, there's a rogue line here. No, that's not a rogue line. I need to finish that line. That's the problem. That's the... Well, there's your problem right there. It's uh, Jamie. No, not Jamie. Not Jamie Heineman. Who's the other... Uh, the other guy from Mythbusters? Okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, it's because I'm on the wrong... Oh, we'll just use this. We're not going to worry too much about it. All right. So, this has been... This has been... Get to the white... Because I seem to be doing them exclusively in white lately. Uh, where am I going to write this? Everything is too big. Let's shrink it down just a little bit. So I can get some space at the top here. For this, this has been... Let me get back to it. Sure, the chisla. The chisla. 20 minute monsters... Uh, germ lane. And it's me, Torrin Atkinson. Uh, that's not how I do it. I do it the other way. Twitch.tv slash Torrin Atkinson. I've enjoyed this. Uh, drawing the germ lane, the jinxkin jousting for jellies, jujubes, jelly jujubes, a jar of jelly jujubes. Several mummies just dropped into the chat, said hello, says hi, to be, to, to quote correctly, and I say to you, hello. So the last thing we need to do uh, before we leave today is take a look at next week. What are the options for next week? We've got Camadan. No, yes. When the next week is letter K, Camelan, pretty good. Kelpie, Kenku, a very popular uh, uh, avian race, and Kargra. I have no idea what that is. Kilmulis, and Kuotoa. I've drawn many Kuotoas in my time, so that might be a fun uh, refresher for me. But if anyone has any strong opinions. You can voice them now. You can voice them uh, in um, in uh, my social medias if you uh, want to find me, Torn Atkinson on Facebook. I don't use. I don't think. I think my I think my official username is Thickets. I'm not sure. Anyway, um, Uncle D, you fractured your big toe. How did you fracture your big toe? Tell us the story sometime, but not right now because I gotta go and get ready. Um, sorry to hear that. That's a crappy uh, Christmas gift to yourself. Um, so this has been 
Torin Draws. I'll see you next week. Same time, same bat time, same bat channel. And uh, have a great... Hey, guys. Have a... Oh, oh, my God. I almost forgot. I almost forgot. <laughs> uh, here we go. Oh, close that. Uh, don't forget, you can get my Christmas cards, um, which were done with the 20-Minute Monster series. Um, Harpy Holidays is how it all started last year. Uh, these are these are from the previous series, the AD and D Monster Manual. Six Sturges sucking. Look at those Sturges sucking on the steed. And uh, thinking of you this holiday season as thought eaters. Gonna think of you. See, get it. And um, there's the Yeti from the Yeti Years for Yogurt. I think that's all. That's all I've done. I was thinking about doing another one. Uh, I feel like it might be a little bit late now. So uh, yeah. Um, those are on my social media. Contact me if you want. I have printable. Ver if you have cardstock and a um, color printer, uh, you can contact me and I'll send you a PDF file where you can make your own. Put these in. Give these to people. I got to go. Bye-bye.